information technology IT engineering as a career option. Let's look at it. Information technology engineers are the people who bring the full extent of computer hardware and software infrastructure into the hands of the common man in the street, at homes and in the workplaces. So what does an information technology or IT engineer do? Number one, developing new software for personal and commercial use typically involves extensive computer programming. Number two, testing existing software to ensure security usability and versatility. Three, providing suitable networking and computational solutions to organizations of various scales. Fourth, providing technical support and maintenance of computational infrastructure. Fifth, IT jobs are ubiquitous, making IT engineers some of the most employable engineers in the planet. Naturally, Experience in the discipline is valued by a lot of employers and remuneration profusely. How to become an IT engineer? Let's see this. To become an IT engineer, it is a good idea to start getting acquainted with computers as early as possible. If you are in high school and your school offers a computer science elective, go for it. The programming acumen you develop early in life stays with you for as long as you work. After school, it is important to get selected by a premier IT engineering program in a good college. Therefore, most IT aspirants spend long hours studying for their engineering entrances Many people think that IT is a safe discipline because there are way more jobs in IT than in any other engineering discipline. But this is only half true. There are many jobs, yes, but the number of IT graduates every year combined with the number of graduates from other engineering disciplines who switch to IT is equally high. Hence, the IT engineer competes with a much bigger pool, competitors later in their life, making their lives considerably more taxing than what of most other kinds of engineers. So what is the eligibility criteria to become an IT engineer? Number one, Plus two, have to graduate in the science stream with an aggregate of 60%. Bachelor's degree is a must. So, Bachelor of Technology in IT. Number three, Master's degree. Master of Technology in Information, IT, which is an optional. After your Bachelor's in Information Technology, you are almost immediately employable. Hence, from Thereon, you can get higher up the ladder as you acquire more experience and hone your skills. Some IT graduates go on to pursue master's degree in business information systems and other similar specializations. But IT remains one of those streams where work experience trumps degrees. Thanks for watching.